Hey, my name is Ben. Thanks for stopping by. Most showers that I have experienced are generally darker than the rest of the areas in a bathroom. And usually that's because there is no light that is directly above the shower or bathtub. Uh, most of the time you'll have the vanity lights and then maybe one other light in the bathroom. Uh, in this case I have one over there and that would be the only other light and therefore when you have a curtain pulled closed or a sliding door or whatever's there, um, the bathtub or shower tends to be a lot darker. So what type of light fixture should you put above, should you put above your shower in order to fix this? Um, that is, they, there are specific requirements for that and I'm going to go through those now. I'll show you what it looks like here uh, with the light turned on uh, for directly above this shower. So there you go, that's what it looks like. As you can see, the lighting is nice and you are not going to be in the shadows all the time if you put a light in like this one. So I'll show you a close up of what we've got going on. Uh, basically the requirements for a light above the shower are that the light can't be basically dangling down and uh, it has to be rated for wet locations. Here's a light that's above a tub shower. Same situation except for the trim kit has not yet been installed. This is a six inch recessed lighting fixture and that's going to be what I'm going to recommend is to get a six inch or five inch, it could be a different size, but six inch is standard so I kind of go with that. Recessed light fixture to install above your tub shower or shower. And then uh, you can't just use a standard trim kit with a standard light bulb screwed into it because those are not rated for wet locations. So what you're going to want to do <clears throat> is uh, you either have to get a kit that basically is a cover that or a baffle I think is might be the word for it that covers that um, that recessed light and you have to take that cover off in order to get to the bulb or uh, the better thing to do now that they have these uh, LED uh, trim kits all in one is to buy one of these and I'll show you so here it is this is a LED retrofit kit I guess is what they're calling it and I'm putting these in the entire house because they were actually more cost effective than buying the trim kit and the bulb separately so uh, the thing you have to make sure you get one of these and it's the trim kit and the bulb all in one and you want to look on the side and make sure that you can find the spot where it says suitable for damp locations. So as you can see, we are good to go. We've got a recessed light uh, retrofit LED trim kit that is compatible with a five or six inch can, which is what we have. We have a six inch can up there and that light is definitely suitable to go above that tub shower. So this is the way you wanna provide lighting in these areas, a uh, six inch can or recessed light and an LED trim kit that is rated for damp locations and I think most of them are. So uh, that's how you provide lighting to uh, areas above a shower or a tub and uh, I hope this helped you out. If it did, please rate the video up, subscribe and click that little bell icon if you want to see notifications for future videos. I really appreciate you stopping by and we'll talk to you in the next video.